staple in the Portland music community is feeling grateful after getting back nearly $2,000 worth of instruments that were stolen from them. We have a feeling of hope today because of the recovery of these instruments. Fox Wells Chandler Watkins spoke to the executive director of Artichoke Community Music, who says they're fortunate to have these instruments back after several smash and grabs at their nonprofit over the last few weeks. Artichoke Community Music has been in the Portland music scene for almost 50 years, but recently they've been dealing with a problem. A string of burglaries that has left the nonprofit out thousands of dollars. Our front door has been crowbarred open and smashed open. We most recently had one of our big windows opened up. Every time we made, we took measures to protect doors or windows, they would move on to the next window. Artichoke Music's executive director, Paul K. Ward, says it's demoralizing. I got to say, one of the sort of untold stories of these kinds of smash and grab burglaries is that they may only get a few hundred dollars worth of product, maybe, maybe a thousand. In the meantime, we have to spend thousands of dollars to do the repairs, labor, materials, and then it leaves us in in a state where we're not at our best because we have you know, two by fours uh, and and plywood sheets on doors. But this week, some good news. Someone took to social media posting they had found a bunch of instruments and were asking if anyone knew of a store that had recently been broken into. Some community detective work traced the instruments back to artichoke music. I'm so grateful that the call came in. I'm so grateful that the morale of my organization is higher because we're getting our instruments back. Um, everyone came together. Ward says amidst the burglaries, this shows the Portland community comes together when someone needs help. One of the things that Portland, um, even in its worst times, should be able to represent to the world is that it is a resilient town. And that's what we want to represent here. In Southeast Portland, Chandler Watkins, Fox 12, Oregon. In response to the recent string of break-ins, Ward also says they have decided to add security in a creative way. They plan to build frames anchored in concrete over the windows that they'll be putting posters on to showcase the musicians that come to Artichoke Community Music.